Five. Here we go with the start of the fight. <laughs> Mountain Dogs found an early opening and unleashed a big combo. He's tagging his face with the jab. The cool quickly pounds it with a fierce three hit combo. Oh, the cooler needs to regroup his placement. I can't believe how displaced he was by that counter haymaker. Nice counter. He's looking to take advantage of the other guy's mistakes. It's almost like he knows what his opponent's gonna throw before he throws it. Jarring uppercut to the gut. Wow, the cooler's blocked and rumbles to the canvas. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He's gonna find himself in a world of trouble if he gets knocked down again by Hound. Nice two-shot combo. I like his footwork out there tonight. Speed guys need that extra conditioning so they can keep that up. Hard hook lands and starts off a solid combination. The cooler won't last long if he continues to eat combos like that. Solid hook to the body was the prominent punch in that combo. He makes a beautiful move, leaves his opponent guessing, and it enables him to land a big shot. He's looking for his opponent to make mistakes and help him out. He can see him. With a wonderfully timed shot. Hound Dog's got to be thrilled with how well that round went. As we come to the end of another one-sided round, let's take a look at some of the highlights. Take a seat. Snug it off. And let's get focused. All right. I liked what I saw. Breathe in and think about how you just took that round. He's a hard hitter, but you're the smarter fighter. Let's see how things go with round number two. <laughs> Solid right hand followed by a hard left hook. Good two-punch combination from the cooler. The crowd can sense that he's on the verge of collapsing. The cooler with a well-timed clinch looks to me like he just stopped himself from ending up on the canvas. Hound Dog with a big counter that looks to stop his opponent in his tracks. Hound Dog with a nice clean combination. The cooler with a big comeback. Great uppercut, puts him down yet again. You had to know that was coming.
That bell means it's time to start this fight. Mountain Dog can do some damage with a hard power punch downstairs. The uppercut sets off a ferocious three-punch combo. Pacquiao displays his hand speed with a series of jabs. He looks to score with that two-shot combo. Right by that two-punch combo from Mountain Dog. You can just tell this guy got some power in his hands. He keeps his body tight and explosive. If he's not careful, he'll be in encounters all day. He landed a huge shot there. Skillful thing got his opponent off balance and really gave him the opportunity to do some damage. He gets rocked by a three-punch combo. Oh, what a move! The fan opens his opponent up, and then he falls it up by blasting home a cracking shot. He's taking the other guy out of his game plan with effective countering. You gotta love that bulldog type of power style. The crowd loves seeing the explosiveness from these type of fighters. Yeah, combo lands flush for Pacquiao. Pacquiao didn't see that one coming. Lord, this is what the crowd came to see. You can see what a thunderous body shot it was that put him down so hard. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Still 10 seconds remaining. Pac-Man's corner needs to keep the energy up so he can have another round like that one. This fight is becoming increasingly one-sided. Let's take another look at what was an easy round. It always... He's making you look... Round number two is about to begin. Good strategy, you should always try to work off the gap. Manny Pacquiao's caught by two hard shots. If you're gonna come straight forward, he'll step back and counter. The uppercut landed hard and allowed him to finish off his combination with ease. Pacquiao's thumps him with a savage flurry. Nice move to get him off balance and then attack with the hard stuff. Oh, he got pulled there and ended up eating a big counter punch. Good counter hooks as he looks to dictate the pace of the combat. Here comes two hard blows from Hound Dog. It could be a short net of work if he can consistently land combos like that. What a tremendous shot! He goes down from a barbaric punch! It breaks his spirit and brings the fans to their feet! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
I thought this fight might be over after he went down, but he got up and is showing true grit. Oop, leaves himself open to get tagged with a counter. Pacquiao can't get careless. He has to stay focused or he's going to get countered all day. Seconds left in the round. Hammering counter punch crashes home for Hound Dog. Truly, that round was exactly what his corner wanted to see from Hound Dog. Hound Dog might just have this fight in the bag. Let's look at how he dominated that last round. I know that round didn't. Takes. The third round is underway. He really wants to beat him up with shots like this. Pacquiao with a series of jabs. That powerful hook could spell real trouble for Hound Dog. One thing you can do against a power guy is move. It's hard for him to generate a good punch when the target is always moving. Hound Dog is not very happy about being hit with that punch. Huge counter punch throws him back. No doubt about it, this is all out for, for Hound Dog. He goes in with a hard hook of his own. Excellent counter, that uppercut finds his mark. Power guys tend to be slower, and if you can get through their defense, you can slow them down even more. He's really ready to go. He's taking a beating, and you can see that his legs. Oh, Hound Dog could be closing the books on this one with an effective series of punches. Whoa! Russian body shot, take him off his feet, and sit. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's over. Hound Dog did a fantastic job here tonight. He came in looking for a knockout, and that's exactly what he got. The fans are loving it. Things are about to get underway here in round one. Hound Dog with a forceful two-punch combination. So how do you earn the title of most exciting fighter in the world? I'll tell you how. By fighting the way our Turo Thunder Daddy fights. That's how. Hound Dog with a nice clean combination. 
The counter hook looks very effective right now. Gaddy's been caught by a hook he never saw coming. Gaddy comes back with a heavy counter shot. He returns fire. Good quick combination. Good looking jab in front of the left hook from Gaddy. He squarely lands two nice shots. Oh, he's in a world of trouble now. You can see the hurt. Oh, Gaddy's blocked and rumbles to the canvas. One, two, three, four, five, six. He's gonna find himself in a world of trouble if he gets knocked down again by Hound Dog. He gets caught with two quick punches. Good execution. He puts together two nice punches. Thunder's taking that punch pretty well. That's a two-punch combination by Arturo Gaddy. He returns with an uppercut of his own. Gaddy's landed a perfect counterhook. First the jab, then there's the left hook. Gotta make it through these last 10 seconds. Lead hook digs to the body, then a left hook up top. Without question, I'd say that was a better round for Hound Dog. Hound Dog might just have this fight in the bag. Let's look at how he dominated that last round. Go! That. Let's get going with round number two. It's almost like he knows what his opponent's gonna throw before he throws it. Good classic boxing style there. That's the kind of style you see in boxing textbooks. Solid jab sets up the right hand to the body. Threw him back. He's really in trouble now. He never even saw that punch coming. Shoots a counter hook. Wrist clean counter punch from Arturo Gaddy. He can see his opponent's punches coming. And he counters with a wonderfully timed shot. Nice counter. He's looking to take advantage of the other guy's mistake. A well-timed clinch may have bought some time for Gaddy. He made some pay for going after him there. Outdog showing us his counter-punching skills. This power forward may not move like Sugar Ray, but all they have to do is plant those feet, and you better not get in the way of the punches after that. Amazing power hook does some real damage and sends him reeling. Hound Dog's hurt. His legs are losing stability. And I'm not sure he'll last this round. He lands a powerful counter that sends his opponent stumbling. Hound Dog's proving that if you reach in against the counter puncher, you're gonna get countered. He's pounded hard by a devastating haymaker. It sends him to the floor. What a shot! 
And there it is! Boom! That body shot landed with enough force to break a rib. And... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine! Down to the last ten seconds. Hey, the replay doesn't lie. He was simply dominated in that round. You need... Here comes round number three. A couple of nice punches from Hound Dog. Yanni's found an early opening and unleashed a big combo. Hound Dog with an unbelievable display of punching power. Our three punch combo, including a solid hook to the body. Hound Dog's return fire. And he comes back with an authoritative uppercut. He's just a well rounded boxer. Good speed, power, great balance footwork. Wow, he's off balance now. That counter haymaker surprised him. Boom! And the crowd explodes as he stumbles from that huge shot. Oh, he takes a tremendous punch as he got crossed up by the face and had no idea what was coming. If you see your opponent's hands tight to the body and face like that, taking small steps forward, then he's probably looking to get way on the inside. That's bully fight. Hound dog. Won't last long if he continues to eat combos like that. Thunder clocks his opponent with two vicious shots. Crashing. That haymaker sent a clear message of destruction. Seconds left to go. Thunders got me thrilled with how well that round went. Arturo Gaddy's clearly in control of this fight. Here we'll take a look at what he did in that last round. You're letting him dictate. Here we go with the fourth round of what's been a great fight thus far. That's the kind of punching you want to see from Hound Dog. Tremendous two-punch combination from Gaddy. Using the jab wisely and consistently. He returns fire and lays up punch of his own. Gaddy's got to work out protecting himself after he throws, or he's going to continue to get tagged with counter shots. And that haymaker ignites the crowd. taking a beating here tonight and he's looking pretty damaged now his legs aren't steady anymore and if he gets hit with one more big punch he's gonna go hound dog's legs look weak can he survive the round if you're gonna come straight forward he'll step back and counter <laughs> He's 
putting his punches together well. Good execution on that two-punch combination by Hound Dog. What action! He knocks his opponent down yet again! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He eats a straight <laughs> shot to the head. Ten seconds to go. Jab combination lands flush for Gaddy. <laughs> Is exactly what his corner wanted to see from Gaddy. Take a look at the reap. It always feels. Where's your? Here we go with round number five. Let's see if he makes any adjustments after being tagged with that combination from Hound Dog. Boom! He's picking his spots beautifully. Oh, he really bit on that face. And he had no idea that there was another punch coming behind it. He really left himself open and got tagged. Punches look to win tonight in dramatic fashion for Hound Dog. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's over. <laughs>